Fox Carolina is committed to you and fall for Greenville starts tomorrow. The festival celebrates food and music making its return after being canceled last year due to the pandemic. Well, we know a lot of you are making plans to head out and check it out and small businesses and restaurants cannot wait to serve you. Fox Carolina's Matt Koufax live for us downtown tonight uh, near McBee and Lauren Street. Uh, we know this time uh, tomorrow and Friday, Matt, things are going to look a whole lot different on Main Street. Tori, they really are. Police are getting a head start on this area, though. You can see the barricade on South Main and West McBee, the intersection here. And that's for good reason. We've got a surprise for everybody. The Budweiser Clydesdales hanging out with a couple of my friends right here. They are exclusively in Greenville this weekend for Fall for Greenville. So it's nearly upon us. The excitement is in the air. And it'll also be a huge boost for those whose small businesses have suffered. With every scoop, slice, and case of fresh food, Adam Hayes with Larkin's Restaurant says it feels more and more like fall for Greenville is back. Yeah, it's the most wonderful time of year. Hayes says it's hard to believe they're here after a COVID hiatus that saw many small businesses struggling. This is the biggest event that's happened you know, since this whole crazy pandemic. He adds that for many outfits like his, cooking up ingredients like sirloin tips and shrimp and grits for a successful weekend, it's like a brand new first impression. Brings a lot of people to the city, you know, brings recognition to our restaurant. That's really what it's all about for us. Come out and see this event, see this festival, really get to know some of the restaurants in town, try some of the food, you know, that brings them back. Sticking around in people's mental Rolodex is what he says makes all the difference. We just moved to downtown, so we've seen a lot of the signs and we're super excited to experience that to see what it's all about. It's customers like Angie and Derek Evick that restaurants like Larkin's are after. We're excited to experience it, but be able to walk out the door and walk down the street. And everyone is ready for a good time. We haven't been able to do stuff like this in almost two years now, so my team's really super excited to be able to make all this food for everybody. We want to make sure people have a good time. And if it's through our food, it's through our food. You know, it's one thing to see these guys in a Super Bowl commercial or uh, just on TV. It's an entirely different thing to see them up close. And the Clydesdales are only going to be one of the many attractions this year at Fall for Greenville. This guy taking a well-deserved break right now. He's going to be out and about this weekend with all of them for all things Fall for Greenville, including stuff about the new food and drink tickets. That's going to be very different this year, but they hope more efficient at curbing some of those wait times that you spend in line at the various tents. You can visit our website at foxcarolina.com or check out our free Fox Carolina news app. Tori, plenty more to come.